642, welcome back. Word on the street is a local librarian is a national Scrabble champion. A Burbank High School librarian recently won in her division at the National Scrabble Championship in Las Vegas in July. Sarah Costa spoke with the Scrabble champ about her love of text tiles and what it takes to never be at a loss for words. My mom liked Scrabble and my aunt, they were both, you know, wordsmiths, they loved it and that kind of just got me interested. From just interested to a Scrabble champ. Jennifer D. Walshy, the librarian at Burbank High School, won first place in Division Four at the Scrabble Players Championship in Las Vegas this summer. It was her husband that got her into playing competitively. It's actually how they met. We played our first game on our second date, and I beat him. It was words at first sight. But um, he knew that I was a player, so I got his attention. Jennifer says her competitive career started out like a bag of jumbled letters. Her first tournament in 2012 was a HOT mess. I lost every game and I wasn't sure if I was cut out for that because I was pretty competitive and I didn't like losing that much. But by my third tournament, I actually came in second and won like $25 at that tournament. She says she began teaching Scrabble at her then middle school as an after school club. 29. That helped her become the queen of the Scrabble dictionary. And the highest scoring word that Jennifer's ever played inquired for 203 points played as a triple triple but what about the word that helped her win at nationals stalker s-t-o-c-k-e-r at the championship jennifer went on a winning streak winning 14 games in a row and says that word helped her come back in a match that she thought she would for sure lose I and mean, i was losing by over 100 points in the middle of the game and i was almost giving up but i drew the blank which was very helpful i got a bingo down and then um, had the blank, drew the E that I needed, and I was able to put the word stalker down. Which helped her stock up on the points and win her division. Her advice to those who want to play like her, read a lot, study your Scrabble cheat sheet and player's dictionary, and have board vision. And knowing you know, when to open up the board or shut it down or finding those great plays, it's strategy, you know, it's the art of competition and learning how to be a gracious winner and a gracious loser, you know, so there's just so many things that you get out of Scrabble. For KSAT 12 News, I'm Sarah Costa. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.